Hey, what's going on, guys? Um, it's Coolzy here, aka Richard Waldron. Welcome back to another YouTube video on my new phone. Um, today I'm going to be showing you a cool deck in Clash of Clans. It's a defensive deck. It's not much of an offense deck. It can be used for pushes if you want to, but I don't know if I'd recommend it. So uh, first, I'm going to show you with the training, and then I'm going to show you an actual match. So here's what you do. Mostly, so you wait for them to attack first. Good luck. Oh, I don't care, Sybil. All right, let's wait for them to attack. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, you see, you see that? I just placed down my baby dragon. I'll move that up there, and uh, we're just gonna use a zap on the skeletons right there. And we're just gonna send a witch down, maybe some spear goblins, and then now we're gonna save up because if they start pushing on that side then uh, we'll be screwed, right? So, that's, that's a fairly good push for the beginning. I mean, it's not the best, obviously. But, being that this is a defensive deck, as you see, I just put barbs down to defend against the, uh, whatchamacallit, hog. So it can be used as an offense deck, obviously, because that tower's about to be wrecked. We're gonna send down my mini Pekka. And then we're gonna maybe put down a bomber. Alright, yeah. So, you know, everyone knows this. Like, once you get one tower down, you should just defend the whole rest of the time. That's basically what I'm gonna do, to be honest. Alright, let's do this. Just defend the whole time so that uh, you don't lose a tower in the process of a rush. And that's mostly why this is defensive deck, because you can pretty much counter anything. To build a good push, you just put one of these babies down. Or to stop a huge push from the other person, you put one of those down. It varies a lot. Now, usually you'll put those guys like back here, but I did not do that for a specific reason. Mostly because I didn't need to. So, yeah. Yeah, as you see, the push is starting again, so we're just going to continue this push on. Ooh, that was perfect timing. I should not have done that even though... It was a perfect timing. As you'll see here, he's going to start taking damage down from that. We're going to put barbs there, and we're going to zap it up in there. Bam! Let's go. So as you can tell, we're keeping a good defense. And uh, not as much offense. I mean, we did come up with a good push. We're just going to push now. Now let's save up. We're saving up good. As long as he can make it over there, we'll be fine. Alright, just make it over there. We'll be fine, we'll be fine. Just make it over there. With the witch, um, some spear goblins. What else do we need to do? Alright, that, that's another tower, guys. So we're doing that good. We need to just block this. And bam! That's the match won. As you could clearly see, that's how you win. Pretty awesome, right? So, I, I don't even know what I've been saying. I've just been kind of talking. But, now let me show you an actual battle because trainers are fairly easy to defeat. Um, so, yeah. I'm just going to start opening that. I've been doing bad lately. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Jeff Butt. Savage Nation. Okay, that's a nice name, Jeff Butt. Alright, let's defeat Jeff Butt. So we're going to wait for him to go first, like I said, remember, uh, I think we should send our witch down. Yeah, our witch will do good against that witch. Oh my god, he has neared it. So that's when we send down baby dragon. Mostly because I'm scared. <laughs> and we'll send down spirit goblins. Mostly because I'm scared again. And then we're just going to zap him to death. There we go. So we defended that fairly well. They did not get one hit on us. Now, we might actually get a hit on them, which will be amazing. Yes! You're actually getting hits on them, which is awesome. So, what should we, what else should we do, I think? I think, oh, uh, we should just wait for them to play. Sometimes with this deck, it ties. So, yeah. If you do play Clash Royale, I would recommend this deck. I was at Arena 5, and I mean Arena 4, and I got Arena 7 with this deck. 
if you're a low level or low arena, you can use this deck to get up here. That was a bad mistake. Why why would I put them down? I was being stupid. But we are so are gonna start kinda of push. Make him mad. This is gonna make him really mad, I think, because uh this like this giant skeleton running at his face. And uh, he can't stop it. By the looks of things. He's he's having really bad luck. Oh dear. I feel bad for him. Oh my god, that, that tower's destroyed, now all we do is defend, okay? You see that? You see that? that? That's an easy win. All you gotta do now is just pay attention. Don't let them take down your tower. We'll be fine, just take him out. There we go. I was gonna use that zap, but I think we should... Oh my dearest. Just gonna have to put him down. You get in the way. <laughs> Dude, he's rushing pretty hard. It's it's kind of scary, actually. We just gotta hold this rush off. That was simple. See, like you can hold a rush very easily if you want to. Hop, doggy, ding! Oh, just wreck him! Come on, wreck his face off! See, this is how you win. He can't win now, so it's pretty awesome. I'm gonna just say good game, man, and uh, well played, because he did play that very well. So, it may take forever sometimes to win these matches, but man, you still win, right? I'm getting my little touch back, but uh, yeah. Ooh, donate. I always donate to get extra experience. That's another tip. Donate to get experience. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. So please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more awesome content like this. Um, let's make a like goal for about 10 likes. Yeah, that's right. I said 10. If I get more, you'll impress me way too much. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, peace out.